Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, I'm going to show you the easiest method that you can use in order to install Android apps in Windows 11 with a Windows subsystem for Android, of course. If you don't have the Windows subsystem for Android already installed on your system, I recommend you go in the article down below in the description because there you'll have more information about how to install the minimum requirements and so on and so forth. The process is really simple, so that's why I don't show it again in this video because I've showed it in previous videos and in multiple articles. So just follow these first steps from this article and you'll manage to install the Windows subsystem for Android. Once the Windows subsystem for Android is installed, all you have to do is to enable the developer mode and then click on manage developer settings. Once the Windows subsystem for Android opens up, you can close it and you can minimize the Windows subsystem for Android settings. To install Android apps, we're going to use WSA tools. This is an application, a third party application that was created by Simon Franco. And this app is a symbol APK installer for Windows 11 designed to be intuitive and make the user instantly feel at home. So you're going to see that the interface is really simple. I'll leave you this link down below in the article from the description because this developer had some issues with the Microsoft Store. The app was removed a couple of times. So you're going to have to access this link. Then you're going to have to click on get and then click on open Microsoft Store and the Microsoft Store from Windows 11 will be opened up and you're going to have the app here. Just click on install wait for the app to be downloaded and then installed. After the app is installed, you need to click on open to open the app. And all you need to do is to do the first setup. Basically, you're gonna have to click on select an APK and then install because we don't have ADB currently installed. Click on install. Now you're gonna need to select the folder where you want to install ADB. I recommend you install that in a folder that you're never gonna move or delete. But for this video, I'm just gonna install it on my desktop in the WSA folder and add for ADB is installed. All we need to do is to load up an APK to install. I'm just going to select an APK that I know can be installed. Of course, be careful where you download your APKs from because certain APKs maybe don't work or have certain modifications. Be aware where you download your APKs from and then just click on load APK and the WSA tools app will get the app name, the version and stuff like that. And then you just have to click on install. It's going to connect to the Windows subsystem for Android as you can see it's going to open it and then it's going to start to install the application. What I want you to know is that in the article down below in the description, you're going to have also the GitHub link for WSA tools where you can leave feedback um, regarding issues and stuff like that. Make sure to give this creator a lot of love for creating this app because these apps are not easy to create and um, it also has a very minimalistic design and a really nice design in my opinion. So make sure if you use the app, give him on the Microsoft Store a five-star review. And if you find bugs or issues, report them in the GitHub link. And as you can see, the application is successfully installed. And of course, if you want to install another application, just click on install another app and you'll be redirected to this page again. Select the APK, load APK, and so on and so forth. Install as many APKs as you want. I'm just going to click on open app and it's going to open the Instagram app that I've just installed. And of course, you can do and try this with certain apps that you want. Be aware where you download your APKs from. So as I've said in the description down below, you're going to have the article for this video. And also the second link will be the article on how to install the Windows subsystem for Android. Also in the article from this video, you're going to have the WSA tools link from the Microsoft Store. And also the GitHub link for this application where you can report bugs and other issues. I'm hoping this video is useful. I just demonstrated to you how easy it is to install APKs in Windows 11 using WSA tools. So make sure to check out the app if you want to test out this process. Don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.